so yeah these things are just really really beautiful and cool okay so this is just one of the cheapest and coolest things you can get someone for christmas it's a silica ball but it's been doped so it's actually phosphorescent right you leave this out in the sunlight and you sort of put it into the dark and it will just about glow you can't really see anything on this one but you put it in strong sunlight and then take it into the dark it glows but that's not the interesting thing you also will need for this three lasers and they almost all now come with these little um diffraction gratings. The reason these are cool is they split up the laser like that and then you just turn that and you can get some really trippy laser shows on the roof. Um, now obviously I would uh, uh, keep these, um, yeah, unless you actually stare down them they're probably fine. I wouldn't trust the power ratings on any of these things but generally the, the handheld things as long as you don't look down the beam um, it's no problem the green is a bit flaky for some reason. Needs to be much brighter than that. These these are the cheap ones from China. So these are about yeah, three bucks a shot. As is uh, the ball. So you'll recall from our spectrum that we've looked at previously, they look something like this, and the the ultraviolet is the high energy end of the spectrum. That's basically what gives you um, sunburn and skin cancer and all that sort of thing. Then the bit in the middle you can actually see quite well and then this at the far end is the red end of the spectrum, the low energy end of the spectrum, the infrared end of the spectrum and that's mostly where you feel the heat. So we have our green in the middle somewhere, we have our violet over there somewhere and our red over there. Actually yeah, they, they, they get them in there somewhere, anyway, it doesn't matter. So now comes the really cool thing, um, what happens if I take my red laser and shine it on my phosphorescent ball and it's very red, wonderfully red, but Death Star, Death Star's blowing a boulder on. But bottom line, there's no glow from that whatsoever. Okay, so that's the red end of the spectrum. Oh, this one, I think this one's better for green. Oh, look at that, boom. Plug up Alderon with a eco-friendly laser. So this is like the middle of the spectrum, out here somewhere. And even with all that juicing on the phosphorescent ball, you get absolutely nothing. Now. now, let's try with blue and pow, and it glows, it's really cool, so you can actually, and it really does, um, it, you can actually see this in, this is a, it's a reasonable not full daylight, but it looks like you're carrying around radioactive waste. So it's just so cool. All right, so what's actually happening here is you've got two energy states in here for the phosphorescence, right? So you need at least that much energy in your photon uh, to kick it up and make this stuff glow for a long period of time. And the red photons, they're low energy. They don't have enough energy to get up there. And the green photons, they still don't have enough energy to get up there. And then the, 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 the purple end of the spectrum has more than enough energy to get up there and it falls down to, into the phosphorescent state, which actually does this. But the reason this is so much fun is it's just so cool to do stuff like this. Whee! <laughs> My little happy face. So yeah, they're like three bucks a piece. And <laughs> it's great fun. Ooh, the power of the dark side. Your feeble skills are no match for the power of the dark side.
Okay, so it's night time. I can just about see those glowing with the naked eye, but only just. Anyway, so here's red. Nice. Here's green. Oh, even brighter. Sort of give you a bit of yellow, which is eh, only just. Okay, and now for blue. Ho ho. Ho ho, that's just off the specular reflection. It's just so cool. You see what I mean? They've really put out quite a lot of light. Now, I have the power. That's fantastic. My glow rocks. You see what I mean? You actually read by these things. Incredible. the universe in my hand. 